How to Benefit from Your Circumstances by Tom Ceased. What are circumstances? That's an excellent question, as you probably won't find it in a dictionary. I must confess that I took a chance and just made up a word. It seemed like the thing to do. As you might imagine, I derived my new word from the word circumstances, which happens to be in the dictionary. Here are some definitions found in some online dictionaries. Facts or conditions connected with or relevant to events or actions. State of financial or material welfare. Conditions, details, parts, or attributes with respect to times, places, manners, agents, etc. that accompanies, determines, or modifies facts or events modifying or influencing factors. Bad circumstances. Often, we seem to find ourselves in bad circumstances. We tend to remember these circumstances years later with much more fondness than we do while we are living or enduring the circumstances. Eventually, these stories may change in nature over time and these bad circumstances become the fables of lore. As an example, I used to walk naked and barefoot uphill one mile both ways to school because my parents didn't locate our house in the schoolyard. Good circumstances. Sometimes we find ourselves in good circumstances we tend to dwell on these circumstances and try to lengthen their duration because we enjoy the benefits of the circumstances. The fables of these good circumstances seem to change over time and are remembered with fondness over the years. As an example, I've been informed that even though my 2003 Chevy Venture has over 275,000 miles, I am still eligible to purchase an extended car warranty. Just imagine my good fortune. Imaginary circumstances. Just as most of the memories of these actual circumstances change over the years, we tend to remember these circumstances when we are faced with new decisions that may lead to events that place us in new circumstances. We tend to assume that because these events in the past led to either bad or good circumstances, that the results will always be the same when we make similar choices. As an example, if someone had bad experiences in their first relationship or marriage that led to many bad circumstances, this would or could lead that person to assume that all future relationships or marriages would or could be the same. Analysis paralysis. As we age, mature, grow up, or all three, we tend to take longer to make decisions and spend more time contemplating changes as we tend to worry or wonder how it will affect our circumstances. We tend to ask questions like, how will this affect my retirement? How will this affect my health? How will this affect my family? How will this affect my relationships? How will this affect my work? How will this affect my legacy? Circumstances. I've often been told that I take many risks but I prefer to take chances. Circumstances are circumstances that provide new opportunities. Usually, when presented with new circumstances, I'll make a couple of quick calculations and then to decide to embrace the circumstance. I know the outcome of each circumstance can be good, bad, or indifferent, but I generally learn from each circumstance. Everything you have ever wanted is sitting on the other side of fear. George Adair. 
seize the day. Like the young Robin Williams in the movie Dead Poets Society, I encourage you to seize the day. New circumstances provide new opportunities for learning and growth on a regular basis. Yes, some of them may end in dire circumstances, but you won't ever get to better circumstances if you don't embrace new circumstances.